Hey what's up guys it's Nick back with another quick iPhone update tip that could totally save your day. So, your iPhone's stuck in recovery mode? Maybe you see that cable to computer screen or it's been sitting there after an update and just won't boot up. Yeah, super frustrating. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through how to get your iPhone out of recovery mode, whether you've got a computer handy, another device, or just the iPhone itself. Alright, let's get started. Now, when your phone is suddenly not working well, you can always try a force restart first. I know, it sounds basic, but you'd be surprised how often this just works. Here's how. Click volume up, then down. Then hold the side button, keep holding it until you see the Apple logo come back up. Once it shows up, you can let go, give it a second, and sometimes it just boots up normally. Now, if your phone is an iPhone 15 or newer and you've got another iPhone running iOS 18 or later, either yours or a friend's, you can use that second iPhone to help. Now, once you're on the recovery screen, keep clicking the side button, just keep doing it until the Apple logo blinks. Okay, when that happens, let go. In just a second, you'll see the Apple logo come back, but this time it'll kind of fade in and out, which means wireless recovery is starting. Eventually, you'll see this screen. That's exactly what you want. Just follow the on-screen instructions and it'll walk you through a full system recovery, wirelessly. Then follow the prompt to choose the exit recovery mode option. Super easy, especially if you're stuck somewhere without a computer. All right, if your phone do have problem that needs to be recovered and you have a computer, this method can update your phone. Plug your iPhone in your computer, then open the app. The app will give you two options. Update or restore. Always try update first. It attempts to fix the issue without deleting your data. If that doesn't work, restore is your last resort, but that will erase everything, so make sure you have a backup. Now, if you don't want to lose your data but the update still won't go through, you can use a repair tool like Rayboot. It can fix system issues without wiping your phone. And if you're looking to upgrade to a developer beta or install a specific iOS version, check out my previous video, I go over that in detail there. So yeah, if this helped, drop a like, maybe subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.